What's up, the John Squad? This is John Pillion here, your YouTube World Heresy Champion here on YouTube, and I'm coming to my WWE Monday Night Raw review for May 13, 2019. So let's do this, shall we, the John Squad? So we we start off the Monday Night Raw with Miz TV, right? And the Miz welcomes us to the international edition of Miz TV. Miz talks about his match against Shane McMahon at Money in the Bank. That's just that Money in the Bank. The Miz introduces his guest Roman Rings. Roman Rings comes down to the ring, but Elias cuts him off and the big dog, Roman Rings, says Elias <laughs> Elias is a karaoke performer and a wedding singer. That was pretty funny right there when he said that. So then Elias and Bobby Lashley ambush Roman in, in The Miz. And Roman Rings in The Miz. And Shane McMahon announces a tag team match. So we have ourselves a tag team match for the first match. So we have The Miz and Roman Rings versus Bobby Lashley and Elias. And the match ends with Shane McMahon interfering and beating up on The Miz and Roman Rings. And, a lot. and then next thing you know is that Miz and Roman pick up the win by DQ. Roman and The Miz both. The, Roman takes out Shane. And so does The Miz with the steel chair. And takes out Elias and everyone else. And Bobby Lashley and... Roman and the Miz stand tall. So then we had Mojo defeated Apollo Cruz, and he just basically just squashed him basically in this match. So that's what happens there. So now we go on to Lacey Evans comes out first for and, and followed by Charlotte Flair, and then comes Becky Lynch for a double championship women's double. Championship contract for the double, you know, the double women's con championship contract signing for the Raw Women's and the SmackDown Women's Championship contract signing. And the segment ends with Becky Lynch getting put through a table by Charlotte Flair and Lacey Evans as Becky Lynch is beat up on Lacey Evans and Charlotte Flair, but it fails when Becky Lynch gets put through a table by Charlotte Flair and Lacey Evans, and they both put her through a table. So then we had Baron Corbin versus Ricochet, and Baron Corbin defeats Ricochet. After the match, Corbin gets a ladder, put put it into the ring, but but is pushed off the ladder by Ricochet. Then we had Natalia versus Nikki Cross versus versus Naomi versus Dana Brooke in a women's fatal four way match, and the winner was Nikki Cross. And by the way, Nikki Cross replaced it Alexa Bliss in this match. So then we had Rey Mysterio versus Cesaro. Rey Mysterio to be defeated Cesaro. Then we had Seth Rollins hypes up his match against AJ Styles for Money in the Bank. So then we go on to the main event of the night we had was Braun Strowman versus Sami Zayn. And if Sami Zayn was to win, he will be replacing Braun Strowman. At, he will be replacing Braun Strowman and his taking his spot in the Money in the Bank ladder match. So we have Braun Strowman versus Sami Zayn. And they fight all over the arena. And this is a false cut anywhere match. And Baron Corbin gets involved. And so does Drew McIntyre. Drew McIntyre, DDT Strowman. And onto a chair, and Sami Zayn gets the win. So then, after that, Braun Strowman recovers and puts Sami Zayn right through the table to end WWE Monday Night Raw last night. So then, once again, the John Squad, please like this video, leave your comments down below, and subscribe for more. You're all the best, John Squad. You're one of a kind. I love each and every single one of you all. Don't forget to tap that bell on YouTube so you never miss an upload on my videos. I love each and Every single one of you guys, you mean a lot to me. Once again, please like this video, leave your comments down below, and subscribe for more what you thought about Raw last night. I thought it was pretty interesting. I'm glad Rey Mysterio got the win last night, and that's all I can just say. And I'm looking forward to Seth Rollins versus AJ Styles at Money in the Bank. Peace out, the John Squad.